Dyson Hoover, Dyson Hoover, what? Hello everyone, what's the story? Welcome back to another episode of Ryan's Corner. Thanks everyone for coming back, uh, you are deadly. I have trusty Mr. Scissors for this video guys because he got something a little different. We're gonna be doing a, a bit of a Lego haul. There was a load of new sets that dropped at the end of April there and I fucking picked up loads of them. There's some that I still haven't gotten yet. I wanna get more, but um, I'm just gonna do an unboxing of everything that I got. I've been wanting to do this before, but I've usually bought like one or two sets at a time and I'm not gonna do an unboxing of two sets, but I have a few here to get through. I don't even remember what I've ordered, to be honest. I actually forget. So uh, this is gonna be a surprise to, to both of us. Yeah, well, here we go, guys. This is uh, box one, it's the big box. Um, I think I know what's in this one, I'm not sure, because I got two boxes. Uh, we'll get to it. How the fuck's this open now, hold on. I'm gonna turn this around, guys, don't don't dox me. How you all doing anyway, guys? How you getting on? It's good to see us. I have no idea when this is going up. I know I say this all the time, but I actually don't know when this is going up. I've been wanting to get these these sets for a while. Is that it? So don't. Let's go, boys. Am I even in frame? Am I? What the f This is the weirdest fucking packaging ever. Oh, I see. It's one of them lift the. Okay. We're getting it, guys. Don't worry. Jeez. They don't want me to have this Lego. We're here. There we go. Oh, shit, boys. I'm excited. Fuck all the bubble wrap there. So in here, guys, I have um, all three of the brand new Star Wars sets that just launched. Holy fuck. I don't know which one to start with, guys. I don't, I don't know. I'm buzzing. Fuck it, we're gonna jump in with the big boy. Bang, this is the brand new Lego Darth Vader helmet. Holy shit. Yeah, guys, I've been buzzing for this one. Uh, this is one of them ones that's kind of divided a lot of uh, opinions within the Lego community. A lot of people love it, a lot of people hate it. But uh, of course I'm gonna do my own review on this and I'll let you know what I think of it up close when I have it. I've seen it and I've seen some reviews and I'm a bit like, oh, that looks cool and some of them I'm not sure, but I think it's one of those things that you need to get in person and see for yourself, you know? So we're gonna do a review on this. I can't be asked to tally up all the, all the money I spent, so if someone wants to do that for me, work away. This one was 70 euro, guys. So this is the most expensive helmet that Lego have ever done to date. This is 70 euro, so this is gonna have a lot of question marks around it in the review. Is it worth the 70 euro? Why is it such a jump compared to the other Star Wars ones that we've gotten before? Um, so anyway, we'll get into that when, when, it, when we do its own video. Pop him there. Next up, guys, we've got, bang, we have the Lego Star Wars Scout Trooper helmet. Holy fuck, I'm excited for this one. Now, in contrast to this helmet, this is actually the cheapest helmet that Lego have ever done. This was actually 50 euros, guys, the cheapest helmet Lego have ever done with Star Wars or any other theme. So I'm super excited for this helmet, guys. This could be one of Lego's best. Uh, so I'm super excited for this. And if this is best that it's at its price, they could do more of these types in the future. Um, so I'm buzzing for this, guys. This is the, I'm, I'm really looking forward to that one. And last but not least for this box, guys, we have Bang, we have the Lego Star Wars probe droid here, the Imperial probe droid. I am so excited for this, guys. Yeah, guys, I haven't got any of these kind of statue slash UCS sets. I know there's like the Baby Yoda and there's like the regular Yoda or the Dio or there's the brand new R2-D2 that just launched that I'd love to get around to, but I don't know, it's super expensive. So this is my first of this type of build and holy shit, I'm excited for this one, guys. I'm really excited. This again was 70 euro, guys. Just letting you know the same price as the Darth Vader helmet. The Darth Vader does have a lot more pieces than this. So this kind of begs the question of why is it 70 euro? But once again, we'll get into that in the future. I'll do its own review. It probably has some custom pieces or you know yourself and uh, it kind of has, it might have a plaque, a detailed plaque and that would have brought up the price uh, for printing and stuff. But um, we'll see in the future when I do reviews on all of these guys. Throw the box down there. So there you have it guys. This is the uh, three Star Wars sets that I got for April. Let me know which one of these you want to see me review first. Um, the most popular one I'll, I'll do, okay guys? But it doesn't really matter to me. I want, I'm buzzing to review all of these. So I'm going to put these down here guys. And we're going to move on to the next box. Jeez, the amount of money I'm spending here guys. Fucking hell. Someone counted up. Someone let me know. You, you know who I'm talking about. You know who I'm talking about who adds up all my fucking money. You, you know. You know who I'm talking to. I need to stop, guys. I, I seriously need to stop. Anyway, box two. Whoa. Bang. Here we go, guys. Now, this box here is slightly smaller, guys, but I do think it contains more. I can't actually remember. And you guys, let's jump in. Let's open this thing. Snip this. And you guys, let's jump into this. Oh, holy fucking shit, boys. This, this is cool. What the fuck's this? I don't need bags of air. What the fuck? First off here, guys, we have... Bang, we have these Lego tulips. Yeah, I just picked these up, guys. These were a tenner, I think. 
Um, I just thought it'd be something nice to pick up, something different. Let me know if you want to see me do a review on this. It'll probably just be a super short video like some of the others I have on the channel. But um, let me know if you want to see me do these. I know my, my agent got this like little vase and she was looking for flowers to put in it. And I was like, I can get a little Lego flower. So this is a tenner. I just picked it up while I was getting this massive order, you know. And they put him over there. Next up, guys, is something that I've been super excited for. And something, once again, that has caused a lot of controversy within the Lego community. It's the... Bang, it's the Lego Batman 1966 Batmobile. Holy fuck, lads, I've wanted this for ages. I am so excited for this. Yeah, there's like the Lego Batmobile that came out and I wanted to buy it and then it just went extinct. They retired the set and it was super expensive and I was this close to buying it. And then they announced this set and I was like, holy shit, no, I'm getting this set. But uh, yeah, I can't wait to do a review on this, guys. I can't wait to open it up. I have so, I already have so many Lego sets to get through and now I'm buying this much more. Holy fuck, holy shit. And you guys put, up, put him off to the side. Now guys, next up here, we've got, bang, holy shit. Is the lighting all right? Lighting okay? Yeah, 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 sure, fuck it, sorry. This is the brand new Lego Marvel's Venom helmet, holy shit. Um, this is gonna look perfect next to my Iron Man one because this is the only, I think this is the second uh, Marvel one that they've done in terms of these helmets. All the others have been Star Wars. I now own all the Star Wars helmets and this is my second Marvel one. There's the other Carnage one, the other Carnage helmet that, came, that is coming out on the 1st of May, I think. Let me know if you want me to pick that up. I'll probably do a review on that as well. Yeah, the Carnage set was actually announced first before this and I was going to get the Carnage one and then they announced this and I thought, nah, this is, this is way fucking cooler. Holy shit. Oh, guys, I'm forgetting the prices. This one was 10 euro, like I said. This one is 35. This one was 35 euro. And then this one was 60. This is 60, guys. Once again, guys, I'm going to do a review on all these sets and I'll let you know what I think of them and if they're worth it or not, you know? Um, so I'm interested to see, is this one worth 60 euro? Because it's not a complete helmet like all the others. You can kind of see inside the mouth there. So that's going to be interesting to see what that looks like in person, you know? Once again, we're not going to get too into it now because it's going to have its own standalone video, you know? And last but not least, guys, sadly, this is the end of the haul. I've got one last thing to show you. Um, this is something super small, but holy fuck, am I excited for these. We have these guys. These are the brand new Lego Looney Tunes minifigures that came out. It's just a minifigure series. That's all it is. It's not a set or anything. I bought eight of these guys. There's 12 to collect in total. I bought eight of them. Um, these were $3.99 each. So a little bit cha-ching, you know? Yeah, there they are, guys. I need, a I need a check, actually, see if they sent me the, the right amount. Yeah, I didn't have enough money to buy 12 of them to complete the whole set. Um, but in the future, I might go back and get more if there's some that I've missed. Or I might even get, you know, doubles and, you know, of the same characters. So I'm going to do a video on all of these. Um, and then I'll see if there's any more that I've missed out if you want me to buy any more in the future, you know. Fuck that down there. Yeah, guys, these are going to be so cute. I'm buzzing for these. It's just going to be something different from my collection, you know. Uh, man, I'm, I'm excited for this. Yeah, I'm trying to fit in here somewhere. Is this, is this all right? Yeah, yeah, it should be all right. Here you go, guys. This is the last look of all the sets that I purchased. Let me know in the comments um, how much I spent. Someone please because I can't be asked to do the maths now on this. And let me know which set you think is your favorite and which one you'd like me to review first. I really want to start with the Star Wars ones, so let me know which of these three you want me to do first. And let me know you're just your overall favorite, you know. But don't worry, I'm going to do a review on all of these in, in due time. You know, it might take me a couple of weeks to get through them, but uh, I'm so excited. Holy shit. Thanks for tuning in on this episode of Ryan's Corner. I'll be back with normal Lego videos. This is just something different. I wanted to switch it up. I'll be back with the proper normal reviews, and I still have all of these to get through, and fucking way more. Holy shit, why am I giving myself this much work to do? Check out the gameplay series, check out the uh, the podcast, all that stuff. These are the best. Um, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>